Commit everything you do to the Lord. Trust him and he will help you. Psalm 37 verses 5. Hello beautiful family. Warmest welcome back again to the Love Star channel. Thank you so much for coming back and I trust you're doing so well today. We are all the way to the southern part of the Volta region of Ghana. My Ewe people, we are at your zone. We're making some fit desi, which is very local with some but like, oh my goodness, it was the best. My friend Emifa walked me through this some years ago. And let me tell you, it has always been a hit in the family. So please stay tuned and let's do this together. Number one thing that I love about this recipe is that it has few ingredients. I have my okra here. I have some ginger, garlic, habanero pepper onion and some papushito and the prekese however is very optional so if you lay your hands on some ademe leaves or the ayuyu leaves it will be perfect but i'll be using some spinach to make it work anyhow okay so i'll have my herring powder here all purpose seasoning and some salt i also have some dried catfish fillet which is absolutely great for this dish i have cackle. i have some tolo beef as well and i will be adding my anchovies or kita school boys without this this dish is absolutely incomplete okay so it's now time for me to steam my proteins the percocet the cackle, everything goes in but i'll divide my anchovies into equal parts yes i left the head of the anchovies on because i personally enjoy it and the most important thing that you have to get rid of is the belly because it contains lots of sand once that is done you can enjoy the rest of the fish it's now time for me to do some choppings <laughs> i'll chop the ginger as well and the peppers there's no blending here which makes me love this dish so much you just this one no be blending matter <laughs> you just chop everything this recipe is so so simple so yes, once that is done, I'll add everything to the pot. You can also choose to blend everything, but I prefer it in its raw and fresh state like this. It's really looking great. The garlic goes in as well. So I added my herring powder and I'm going to add my all pepper seasoning. A pinch of salt. And I'll add water. Get more water, cover it, allow it to steam for about 5-10 minutes. I will be cooking my okra in a hot boiling water that contains a quarter teaspoon of bicarbonate soda. I'll go ahead and add, wash my okra, chop off the head because I'll be needing help from my food processor to do the chopping for me it is really really very if you have it please use it and say no to slavery in the kitchen <laughs> so i'll go ahead and chop my spinach i said if you get hold of fresh malokaya leaves please use it or the ayuyu leaves it is perfect and i will add the okra to the boiling water and i'll go ahead and whisk it very well the whisk can also help maintain the dryness or the sliminess i'll be doing the cooking for a very long time so go ahead and add my spinach straight away it will be on fire for about three minutes you do not want to lose the nutrients and all that good stuff okay and be sure to whisk it okay it's very very important It looks so delicious. Now let's go back to our steam proteins. Just have a look at that. It smells so good. I wish you were here to sniff it. You just have to try to know what I mean, okay? So now is the time for me to add the okra. It will cook to just for about three minutes. Look at that beauty to behold oh my goodness this is my favorite part when everything gets to incorporate with each other just have a look at that so good right now all that is left is for me to stir allow everything to incorporate well and add the rest of the abobi that we left do you remember <laughs> yes i love it crunchy in here and i'll add a bit of peppers as well mm, so good 
it's definitely under 40 minutes that you really really need to try it tastes absolutely delicious oh my gosh all that we need to do is to allow it to simmer for three minutes and we're done let's do the swallow pad mm -mm, my throat is doing me something right now <laughs> All that you need for your akule is your white corn meal flour. I'll take about one cup of it and turn it into a porridge form. And I'll just go ahead and cook it on fire until it thickens up. The process of making akule really reminds me of tea sets. It has the same, you know, process and method. The only difference is you need to add salt in this one and it does not need any cassava flour okay so just the same process if you follow you're going to get it right as farm i have shared a tozafi recipe and i'll link it right here for you to watch just in case you missed it okay so yes we are almost on the way to finish with our ballet process and yes i will bring a very delicate and step-by-step -step recipe on the akbale on its own so do not worry okay and my ls here please rate me how am i doing so far So for about 15 minutes we are done with our kule and you have to drive it until you notice that the color has turned into a slightly yellowish color and the kule is also good for those who seem to have a bit of gas when they eat banku because the banku is fermented while this is not so it's perfect perfect for you okay so all that this took us was 15 minutes and we are done ready to be served ah <laughs> this dish is budget friendly super delicious and very healthy as well i'm really surprised why it's not talked about a lot so mfa girl thank you so much sis i'm really really thankful she watches my recipes all the time but refuse to comment i hope you leave a comment on this one for me i also know that this is very popular in togo as well thank you so very much family for watching through to the end please be sure to leave me a comment like the video and also share to free friends and family and most importantly i hope you learned a thing or two thank you so very much family for watching once again and if this is your first time here hello my name is lovia from lovie statue my main goal here is to jay you up into making your own delicious meal right at the comfort of your home i also love to share kitchen related motivational videos so please be sure to subscribe and join the family for amazing new recipes every week thank you so very much for watching once again and just know that you are so so beautiful just the way you are see you in my next one 